Oh, there you are, YouTube. Doodle, 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 do. Subscribe. So uh, let's do a random ranking again today. Uh, what that means, if you've never been here before, is I go to my movie collection behind me and I pick out three movies at random and then we rank them from most favorite to least favorite based on a variety of different reasons. And I also like you to rank them in the comments if you're interested. Uh, I'm always curious to know what people think, how they would rank movies, especially ones that have almost nothing in common. Sometimes they do, not always. Uh, but I always think that's a, a fun exercise is to pick three movies at random, no relationship usually, and then find a, find a way to pick which one's better than the other one. So let's get to picking some movies. Uh, you know, I don't pick down here very often. I'll pick two from here. And then, let's see, uh, let's go down here. All right, so one of the rules is I have to have seen all these movies in order um, to rank them. So if there's one that I haven't seen, I have to replace it with another one. So let's see if I've seen all of these. The Jacket. Yes, I've seen this. Did I? I think I watched this with my... This guy has like hair stuck to it. That's disgusting. Sorry about that. Oh man, you know that like sticky tape that they always put on here so you couldn't like steal the CD? That residue is there and it has like my old... Probably from my thinning hair. Uh, my thinning head of hair uh, stuck to it. Anyway, I, yeah, I remember... Um, my brother-in-law, he's who introduced me to my wife. I was friends with him in graduate school. And then, um, yeah, he introduced me to his sister, and then now we're married. But um, I remember going to his house. This was like the first, or his apartment, the first time like we hung out sort of like outside of like, you know, group activity. It was, it was just like me and him hanging out, and we watched this movie. So that's kind of cool. Um, and then, I haven't opened this yet, but I have seen it, Jennifer's Body. So I picked this up uh, on a Black Friday, that's why it says promo, and I usually only would buy the movies that were a dollar, so this is probably just a dollar. I'm going to go ahead and take it out so there's no glare. Um, but yeah, I actually like this movie quite a bit. I don't remember who directed it. What I remember Diablo Cody wrote it. I think Jason Reitman produced it, but I don't remember who the director was. Karen Kusama. Okay. Yeah, written by Diablo Cody. And then I'm pretty sure... Um, uh, uh, not Ivan Reitman. Jason Reitman. Um, I'm pretty sure he produced it. Maybe. I could be wrong on that. Oh, and then Walk the Line. All right. We got a Best Actress winner right here. And then um, he did not win for this, uh, playing Johnny Cash. I think he did great, though. I like this movie. I need to watch this more often. I think I've only seen it once or twice. There's a, uh, not a spinoff, a spoof of it called Walk Hard with John C. Riley, who I think is hilarious. It's, it's hilarious that he is hilarious, because if you, like, watch his interviews, he's a very serious actor. Um, so if you, like, try to, like... I've seen interviewers try and, like, have fun with him because they think, oh, you're the guy from, like, these Will Ferrell movies. And he's he doesn't really respond back to them in a humorous way. And it's be, it's like he's not a funny guy. He can act funny because he's a phenomenal actor, but it's not like he's out there being a... I, I don't know. It was just, like, very weird. Like, the... the the interviewers were asking him all these absurd questions, and he's like, "I I don't know what you're talking about. That doesn't make any sense to me. I'm just I'm just an actor trying to get work. You know, I I don't know. It was just really weird, awkward, but also funny. So I like all of these movies. How am I gonna rank these? Um, okay, what am I gonna do here? Keira Knightley, uh, Adrian Brody. Also, funny thing is, my brother-in-law looks a lot like Adrian Brody, like a lot. Uh, people say he looks like him all the time. There is another actor, though, I think he might look like a little bit more that has similar features that I can't think of what movie he's in. Um, but yeah, he also looks like Adrian Brody a lot. Okay, so how am I going to rank these? You know, I think, while I do like this film, film, I, I think I do have to put it at the end, but 
you know, I have good mem. I have better like memories of the company than I do this movie. Like, yeah, I like this movie, but you know, it's more the company that I enjoyed when I saw this because I think I've only seen this twice: once on my own, and then once with him, or once with him, and then once on my own. I think is actually the order. Um, and then Jennifer's Body or Walk Hard. You know, I think I'm gonna have to go. You know, biopics. I have a love-hate relationship with. A lot of times I just think they are a boring idea, but then I'll watch them, and then I'll be like, oh, okay, that was pretty good. Not all of them. A lot of them I'm like, that was still a waste of time. But this is the one I like quite a bit. I also like uh, The Queen. That's a really another really good one. I don't think that was from the same year. Maybe it was. I don't think it was from the same year. But that's a, a good one that I love a lot, too. But, yeah, I think this is my order right here. Got the story of Johnny Cash and June Carter Cash. And then here, this this kind of fun horror film right here. And then the jacket, which, again, I have more, like, again, more, more fond memories of watching the movie and the company I was with than the movie itself. But yeah, this is my ranking right here. Walk the Line, Jennifer's Body, followed by the jacket. Sometimes I want to call this the jackal. There was like another movie that came out maybe around the same time. I don't know. There might have been a lot of years apart called the jackal and I'm always almost saying the jackal. Anyway, my question to you is, have you seen these movies? Have you seen any of them? What do you think of them? And if you've seen all of them, how would you rank them? Let me know in the comments below and perhaps I'll see you tomorrow for more Pure Hangout.